Hey guys, so this wasn't really planned at all. In fact, I've recorded a video twice today on two different subjects, but I want to talk about death. Um, it, it's a tough thing to talk about. It's a tough thing to put into words. You know, I can, I can find statistics and find jokes and do something witty, but I feel like that's right now, that's not what I need. That's not, that's not what I want to do. And I, the thing is, I don't even really know what to talk about because I don't really feel qualified to talk about death, to be honest with you. Like, I haven't really had that much experience with it, like, if at all. I have a fam really close fam family member who has been sick for a very long time. And the weird thing, which I just realized, like, a couple minutes ago, is that... I've kind of become used to the idea of death. It's become almost normal. And I don't know if that's right. I don't know. I watched two videos just back to back there. Uh, one was Zay Frank, and then the other one was Soul Pancake. Zay Frank had somebody comment on his video that he needed help. He didn't know kind of how to deal with things. And then three days later, his partner commented on it, saying that uh, he took his life. And so Zay Frank's video is all about pain and about living with it and dealing with it and living itself. And then Soul Pancake did a video series, they just started a video series. Uh, it's called um, My Last Days. And it's every Tuesday. And it's about people that are dying. People that are about to die. And it goes, interviews them and talks about them and goes through their life. And it's interesting, you know, because I'm, I'm not, I'm personally not afraid to die. I don't want to. I, I want to live a, as much of a life as I can, you know, I want a family, I want kids. I want all of those things. But, you know, if it happens, it happens. Like, I feel like I've done enough now that I can be happy, you know? And the thing is, I might not have made a lot of money, I might not have done a lot of physical things, but I feel like... I don't know, I've met enough people that hopefully I've made a positive impact in enough lives. And maybe that's where I want to go with this. I, don't, I really don't know where I want to go with this topic because I started the day off talking about oral sex and I recorded that video and then I recorded a video on fear and anxiety because I was talking to somebody and I realized I had just had this overwhelming fear and anxiousness towards my goals and what I want to do. but. Now that those two videos I did just doesn't really cut it. And so, and may, maybe what it is is that I feel that we should live our lives as well as we can now. You know, like we should make sure that we're doing what makes us happy. Don't make, don't, don't do what makes somebody else happy. Don't do what's expected of you from somebody else. Live your life so that you're happy. You know, do what makes you proud. Think to yourself, if I look back on my life now, would I be proud of what I've done? And the answer is no. Ask yourself, how can I do that? And, uh, like, I don't really believe in heaven or hell or anything like that, so I don't think I'll be going anywhere. And if I do, that's cool, you know? Um, at least it's cool if I go to heaven. I don't think I'd enjoy hell too much. But,. Maybe that's really what I want to talk about today, is living, kind of. I don't know, it's a tough subject. Um, a lot different than oral sex, what I had planned. But I, I guess if there's one thing if I want to say, is make sure that you're living your life in a way that you're proud of. Make sure that you can look back on what you've done and be happy. Um, yeah. I think. I don't know. I don't even know if I've said anything in this video. It's a tough one, guys. Probably, I want to revisit this another time. I think I've just kind of a little bit, and I'm to the point now where I just don't know. I don't know. You ever have those moments where you just don't really know what to say? It's like too many feels all at once, and you just... Hmm. Today's, I don't know. Today's been a slight emotional roller coaster, I guess. But, um, see you tomorrow.